everyone, I'm Melissa Prophet, the Education and Communication Specialist with the Warren County Soil and Water Conservation District, and today we are going to explore wetlands. Now a wetland is a distinct land ecosystem that is flooded by water, either permanently or seasonally. Think about places like ponds or marshes, these are wetlands. Now wetlands have special plants and soils in the ecosystem that are very good at absorbing things like pollutants out of water. So wetlands are known as nature's natural filtration system. Let's take a look at how it works. Here is a model wetland system, simply made out of a halved two liter bottle with some gravel and soil and sand and plants plugged into the end. The idea of this model is that we will add water to the model and watch how it travels through this mini wetland ecosystem. Here we have a glass of water with some drops of food coloring in it to represent our pollution. Let's see what happens as the water goes through the wetland system. As we add the dirty water to the back end of the wetland, we can see how it starts to sink down through the bottle and move across the ecosystem. The soil is filtering the color as if it was pollution. Let's add some more to keep it going. As the water moves through the wetland system, what we're interested in seeing is the output. Once the water has traveled through the wetland, make a hypothesis. Should the water be more clear or more opaque once it's gone through the filtration system compared to the original polluted water? As water continues dripping at the out point, let's see a comparison between the filtered water and our original polluted water. If I pour the output water, first we can notice that the volume is lower because some of this water has been absorbed in our soil. But we can clearly see that a lot of the pollution has been removed. Ask yourself, what water would you rather have in your drinking water source? I hope you've had fun exploring wetlands with me today. This is a demonstration that you can easily do at home or in a classroom as well. It's so cool to look at what kind of environment surrounds us right here in Ohio. Thanks for watching.